Hey guys, welcome back to Reign of Giants. So last time, we discovered a crazy portion of the map and found out that there is a lot more out there. And probably even more than I could discover, uh, seeing as we had to head back because there was a lot of dangers. So this time, I think I might start preparing for winter, seeing as it's slowly approaching towards us. And, as you all should know, winter is coming. Winter's coming. There you go. I did the accent. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, so I have the Sidious Turf I can place. I was thinking about decorating the base, but with winter coming, I don't think there's any point. Because the whole place is just going to get covered in snow. I'll probably do it around... Spring? Yeah, and then prepare up until the winter. I need to be careful doing control F around Glomma. Because if I kill Glomma, then Krampus is going to come for me. Krampus. I never actually ended up watching that Krampus movie. I heard about it. I don't know why I'm going into small talk now, but yeah, whatever. <laughs> I never ended up watching that Krampus movie. I mean, I don't know if it's out or whatever, but I remember hearing about it around Christmas. Did I place these stray bees? Did I place them in the end, I mean, is what I'm trying to say. I don't actually remember if I did, but I'm going to pick these flowers anyway. Because I'm getting a bit low, and I don't really want the bees spreading too close to my base. I want to sort of issue out the sort of area I want them to stick to. Yeah, you can place them around Glamour Statue, sure, make it look nice. I could just place a lot of homeless bees and then all of a sudden the whole place could just be covered. I might do that with like the final three charges I have left on this. I also need to go and uh, pick up our dearly departed friend. He was exiled from the base. Chester, how you doing, my friend? Sorry about that uh, misunderstanding. Wait, what are those killer bees actually doing? They're chasing a rabbit? Really? You've stooped that low. Guys, seriously. Wow. Oh, wait, is this one of the homeless bees that's... Uh, Traveled a little bit out of the boundaries, to say the least. I'll pick all of those up at a later point when I feel like it. Or is this guy? No, he's from the. He's from the home. He's from the home. There is one remaining. I don't know where the other one went. Like there isn't there supposed to be four, and then like in five minutes one regenerates or something like that. Or maybe that's the guy being of a above, above Chester. This guy. I think it might be, but I don't want to risk it just in case he is like some random homeless bee that I placed. There we go. Oh wow. Out. Nice. I wanna place them far enough off the screen, and I think I have to wait for more to regenerate, otherwise they return to the Base, so I'll wait a little while. Maybe it doesn't work like that. Maybe you can't do it with your own bees because they don't regenerate because they know they still exist. Maybe. I don't know. But anyway, I'll chuck these seeds in here with the rest. So setting up for winter, I do have this. That came quick. Winter hat. I'm not going to wear that just yet. But I will keep it in safekeeping in here. Uh, along with the V-Flow wall. Uh, I think I'll keep the beard for winter just because it helps with insulation. And talking about insulation. Let's go and follow this animal track, shall we? A three... 
creature expedition? I guess we're not. None of us are men. I was going to say three man expedition to uncover the long lost koala font. We're all going on a koala font hunt, and we don't know how to weed them out. <laughs> I don't even know if I said that correct. It's been a long time since I watched that. Oh, well. Too many Spongebob memories coming up. Damn. So, this Qualifant, it usually takes about seven, I would say. But there's also the chance for that evil dog. Uh oh, it's probably an evil dog. No, it's not. I am saved by the Qualifant. So, I think I want it to die by spiders. I mean, that's not the kind of thing you want to say about an elephant, but... I don't think you'd ever say that in the real world. It seems like a really odd thing to think about. I want this elephant to die by, uh, at the hands of spiders. How far down did I go? I keep trying to press M for map. <laughs> I'm playing too many M map games. And don't starve together as well. I guess that kind of counts as an M map game. Wrong way, buddy. You need to go to the right. And hopefully, all of the spies will be too distracted on the elephant to actually want to care about Chester. Or I'm just going to have to exile him again. Sorry, Chester. Sorry, buddy. Your time is up. Are they going to try and kill him? I mean... Possibly? But it doesn't look like it. I think maybe he's safe. Well... Or maybe you just have to run into the den. I mean, I don't want him to die off screen, because then I'll lose all of the food he drops, but... I'm not sure of a way for me to kill it myself. I mean, I know there's an attack pattern to it, but I can't remember. I think it's like three hits, run away, three hits, run away, something like that. I'll try it, I'll try it. I'll leave these bees in here until after I'm done with the Qualifant. But he does do a lot of damage from what I can remember. So I'm going to want to be a little bit careful. I do have some rabbits, but don't really care about those at the moment. You know what I could do? I could trap a bunch of spiders and then just release them near something I want to kill. Instead of having to like feed them all and ask them to attack. Oh my god, why did I not think about that? Doesn't this work with the, the spiders in the area of the one you feed, as far as I can remember? It's a bit like the monkeys from Shipwrecked. At least I'm pretty sure, but I need to do it whilst it's night time because they won't respawn otherwise. I'm looking for a group of them. Come on, I've got directional sound turned off. We're all attacking something. Sure, have this. Oh my god. No, no. Yes, I have a few buddies now. Alright, attack. Attack! Attack. There we go. My stuff. That's what I wanted mainly. And I just lost one meat. That's fine. I have a full length, really nice beard here. A uh, qualifant trunk I want to build the thing with. I'm not sure how much silk I need for it though. Uh, these bees I can place in a second. 
Let me just cook up this meat. With this meat cooked up, I can just make a, a whole bunch of bunny hams now. Which should be nice. I'll just go grab the honey. See how many bees we have in here before I drop some more. Two. Okay, that's not that many. But they're all going to die now. That might have been a mistake. Let me just kill these. Uh, no! What is going on? This is madness. I did not want to hit Glamour. I want to kill the spiders before they kill all the bees. Otherwise, I'm going to be out of bees in the bee house. So I can't place any more. I mean, that's now like a mouthful of stuff to say as well. Um, okay. So I chuck one of these in and one honey should do it, right? There we go, I'm trying to sort them out. Seeds and uh, collectible stuff, meats and veg. Still need a dragon fruit. But I'm going to have to wait a little bit longer for those things to respawn. I need to find out how to make a qualifant thingy. However it's said. In here. Does it show up? It doesn't show up, but I'm trying to remember if there's any other uses for them, because... Like... I think it's just used to make the vest, which means I can't wear any backpacks or anything when I'm using it. Or maybe I'll just have to use the stone. Speaking of, I kind of need to make that. I thought it was in survival. Do I need for it? I need more rocks. Okay, do I have any rocks anyway? Let me think. No rocks. No rocks. Well, let's go mining then. The irony. <laughs> what are you doing? I thought for some reason they were going to go and attack Chester. Are the rocks are. Yeah, they're in this direction. It's fine. Come on, spiders. Let's kill some stuff. I'm prefer preferably going for gold rocks, that's why I'm uh, still running. Never mind then. Oh, there's one there, okay. I don't need nitre just yet, I can always just come back here later for the nitre. That's enough rocks, but I want to get a little bit more. Not ice. What are you doing, Gomer? <laughs> Just dumbfounded and uh, having no idea what was going on. Three rocks are always nice. No, I don't want to do too many because then it will just uh, break the pickaxe and then we'll be back at square one. So survival, it hasn't popped up yet. I'm up a little bit, I think. I'm freezing again. What is this madness? That's a lot of bees. Please tell me they did not all just return to their home. Oh, it's spiders versus bees. Okay, I wonder what was going on then. But I needed that more honey for uh, stockpiling winter stuff. Here we go. There is my thermal stone. I don't really need it right now. I mean, I kind of do. If I'm exploring at night time, stuff so could freeze. But I'm hoping the bees from over here did not just return to their home. Which they might have done. Well, there's two, three. No, I don't think they did, actually. Well, that's pretty cool. 
So now I have like an endless source of flowers. Plant some more of these. Get out of the darkness. And I'll eat this just to uh, top myself back up again. And that is pretty nice seeing as the amount of food I got from that. <laughs> Chuck this in just to uh, even out a bit. Might cook up some birch nuts and place some. Chuck in that carrot and that and this. So I actually do have quite a lot of food now. And for the koala hunt trunk, I can't exactly remember what I need. Let me have a look. Eight silk, okay. I think with the beard, um, I kind of want to keep it. I mean, I could get the amount of silk I need if I was just to cut off the beard. But I'd rather keep it. Um, I'm going to expand that a little bit on the digging. Just because there's still quite a bit of night time left. And I was running out on that. Could take this and put it on my person. At least to keep it safe for now. But I think it's fine. I'll chuck this in here. And more gold can go in Chester I guess. Because he's already got like a bit of a stack hasn't he? The gnome can... Oh, it can't be placed down because of the moles. You untrustworthy moles. Um, but yeah, I think... That is most of the setup for winter. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need for the winter. Which I'm in, like, right now. Not to mention. So maybe putting that winter hat on my person isn't a bad idea, right? <laughs> uh, maybe I wasn't expecting it to be that quick. Where did it go? There we go. Open Chester. I don't think it triggers that quick for the cold, so maybe uh, not having it on right now might be a better idea. Um, I put all that gold together and put it in Chester. I did that wrong, didn't I? Uh, I need some silk, so maybe taking down this spider nest is the aim for this winter. Come on now. I'm waiting. Oh, for damn it. Come on, trigger all these spiders. Now, I'm pretty sure they're poisonous, so I don't really want all of them to come after me. Come on, you three. I just want you three. Come on, you three. Damn it. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to take that out. Not as Weber, at least. Um, I have an idea, though. I could do what I did with the monkeys, right? If you know what I mean. Just go on here and feed three of them a monster meat and ask them to attack the den. Yes? There we go. That works. Um, I might need a bit more silk though. Are they all attacking the den? No, they're attacking each other. Right, let me go and give this to them. Right, now attack the den. You mother truckers. Give yourself snow home. I'm not even sure who's on my side anymore. Pretty sure it's the two spider warriors that are on my side. Come on. I'm not waiting around all day for this. Just take the damn nest out. Oh, 
Why is it taking so long? There we go. Attack this guy. Now I have everything I need, and I stop an infestation, so maybe Chester can return. I think we did a good thing today, guys. I pretty much extended to everything I already need. Uh, I got some more health. I have two spider guys on my side. I mean, that doesn't really last, uh, unfortunately. Could do with chopping down some more trees so I can get some more fuel. I am going to have a problem with two homeless spider warriors trekking about the place. Fortunately, they aren't hostile to me, so... Maybe they can attack each other? Yeah, there we go. May yeah, I just kill each other, would you please? I'll uh, be over here waiting. Waiting for the spoils and uh... Hopefully, one of you will win. It's like betting on spiders. And trial by combat. There we go. Spider numero uno one. I didn't give them numbers. Wait, why am I attacking it with that? What am I even doing? Oh dear. What have I done? Right, let me uh, run away. Please. Yep. Are we safe? We are safe. Damn, that I got close. I was even attacking it with the wrong damn item. Well, I wanted to kill it so that I could get the spoils off of both of them. But that's why you don't be greedy in this game. Cook up another honey ham. And thankfully it doesn't matter if you eat the same thing in a row like it does with Wally. Uh, I feel like that was maybe a bit too much of a nerf. It made him really weak. I mean, they did give him more food stuffs, but I didn't learn them, so maybe that's why I felt like he got a bit weaker after that. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Winter has arrived, or as I could still say, winter is coming because it hasn't actually snowed yet, so winter's coming. And if you enjoyed the video, <laughs> kind of lost track there. So then guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to share, like and subscribe. Thanks in advance, and I'll speak to you all next time.